Yo, what's good y'all? It's Bulls and I'm back with something a little different today. So today we're getting a GTA 5 kind of uh, tip on how to go AFK and get your nightclub. Uh, I mean this will fill up any of your businesses but your nightclub especially. So I know I do a lot of 2k content. I want to do some GTA stuff but we'll see how this goes and maybe I'll make a funny series or something out of it. Um, along with the 2k stuff I'm doing 2k is pretty dead right now though so I'm mainly on GTA I play a little bit of MLB so maybe I'll post a little bit of that too but in this video um, first thing you're gonna want to do to go AFK um, personally I find that my motorcycle club businesses if I go AFK while I'm a motorcycle club president I feel like I get raided more often maybe it's not true so I don't know my bunker hasn't gotten raided in years I do have the security upgrade for everything, but yeah, my motorcycle club has gotten raided recently when I'm motorcycle club president. So what I do is I always register as a secure serve CEO, and you'll hear the game audio is muted because uh, I had copyrighted music playing in there, and then the nightclub is copyrighted. But yeah, so you want to register as a CEO. Don't register as a motorcycle club. I don't know if it really makes a difference, but I find that I, I think it does. So after that, go over to your nightclub like you see I'm I'm doing now. Um, if you don't have an Oppressor Mark II, you need to get an Oppressor Mark II. Um, <clears throat> a few things before we get over there. If you do want your other businesses to start filling up, I would go buy supplies at all of them first. I would go to buy, or buy supplies so that when you go AFK, they'll all come in and they'll all start producing product. So by the time you get back, that product has produced. It's not going to continuously do it, but... It'll have whatever supplies you just bought will all be turned into product. So you'll have to go resupply uh, when you come back. But I, like, I'll leave my PlayStation on overnight. But here's how you do it. So you're just going to come over here, go to the garage, and yep, can't, can't walk in the circle. Um, and you're just going to want to sit at the screen. Plug your controller in, make sure your PlayStation is turned to never shut off, and just sit at this screen. If you sit at this screen you will be set. Um, like I said, there's a few times where I forgot to change my PlayStation um, to make sure it never turned off. And also, if you uh, like don't plug your controller in, it'll die. And if it dies, it'll say that the connector to it is lost and please plug it back in and then it'll kick you from the session. So you don't want to do that. So this is what I recommend doing though. So if you want to go in um, after that or before you go AFK, I'd always go in before. So my nightclub popularity is already kind of low, so I'm going to get that up before I go in. But here's what we're going to do. So log on to your computer. I don't know what's taking me so long in this clip, but hit X, TJ, come on. So you get on your computer, and you're going to want to go to warehouse management. As you see, I already have 1.1 saved up, and I'll sell that uh, soon. But the three things that, or the five things that you're really going to want to pick are cargo and shipments, which you need to have a uh, CEO crates or a hanger, sporting goods, which is a bunker, um, pharmaceutical research, which is meth, I want to say, um, cash creation, which is counterfeit cash, and South American imports, um, which is coke. So those are the five you want to pick. Make sure you have all five of those businesses minimum. I have all seven, so when one fills up, I just go and switch it. But yeah, I'd also recommend getting all the upgrades. Um, security, I mean, you can debate if you want to do it or not. Some people say it works, some people say it doesn't. Make sure you get the staff. It'll keep your popularity up at least a little bit while you're gone. But yeah. Um, biggest thing, I would never buy nightclub before you have at least three of the businesses that you need for that. Because um, since they all connect, you won't make a whole lot of money off the nightclub. So I would definitely recommend having those first. I personally, like I said, have all seven so that when one fills up, I can switch it and walk back away. Um, but yeah, so going into the popularity, what I would do is right before you go AFK, come in here. Uh, it'll be either a blue dot, which is someone you got to kick out, or a blue person, which you got to drive. Um, obviously, the driving ones are annoying, but I'm just going to come over here. I'm going to kick this guy out. My popularity is going to go up. And I will be all set. So that's it, y'all. It's Bulls. Hope you like the tutorial. I'm out. Real quick, one last thing I wanted to add on. I realized this while I was recording it. Um, make sure that after you kick him out and everything and you go sit AFK, when you come out, I would immediately disband just to give you some time to 
go in your nightclub, make sure nothing gets raided. I'd immediately disband and then be on something that you can go fast in case something does get raided. Because sometimes if you're AFK for, let's say, nine hours, um, there's a high chance that something might get raided, even if it's your bunker. But, yeah, so... That's it. Hope you all liked the video. I'm going to be back with 2K stuff once we get more info. We've already gotten some, but I want a little more. So, yeah, I'll be back. It's Bulls. I'm out. Peace.